<laughs> okay. Welcome back to Little Nightmares. Talk about your omega megalophobia. Omega I, I hate big thing. And these are big thing, therefore scare me. Talk about Omega. I I have been called fat many time on Omega. <laughs> um Chris, uh how much experience do you have with Omega? None. Uh so I was going on Omega <laughs> and um I, I want to. We should do a stream where I go on Omega, and every time I see a penis, uh, chat has to donate one dollar to charity. How about you do that? Sir? We can fucking solve world cancer. Well, you can't do that on start Twitch. streaming. You will get banned immediately. Yeah, I know. You'll be. You'll get banned for even having. I'll do it on a uh, fucking my free cams or OnlyFans. <laughs> on Bandicam. Shatterbait. <laughs> Shatterbait. <laughs> That's where I should. Uh, that's where I should start my Milkmeister streams on yeah, fucking I just Chatterbait. Stream on Chatterbait, <laughs> but only Pokemon play video games. Dude, do fucking Pokemon Showdown streams on fucking Chatterbait. <laughs> that is the most. That is like equivalent to like game playthroughs. This on is porn such mode. a fucking cool shot. This is. Oh, epic. that's. That's awesome. an, that's another like computer background. It is. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, oh yeah. Me. The only other thing I know about this game is that Six gets her raincoat back eventually. Oh, thank Yo, God. I don't know it's when. It's a magic raincoat. He could al he could already give her the first part of her raincoat. She never, the she never wears the hat. She never has the raincoat. I swear she no, had a hat. She doesn't. I know mm. what she looks like. <gasps> Liter uh, literally, me when um, uh, Bottle Rocket get me added. when nine to five job. That oh. was funny. <laughs> That was a major fucking goof, Me dude. Me when I make a joke. <laughs> <laughs> um, fucking... Yeah, that's offensive to those of us that actually work. Yeah, Anthony. Neither of you have been. <laughs> Fuck off. We have jobs, though. I actually, have, I, I have, have an 8.30 to 4. Fuck you. I have a story. Yeah, but it's not a 9 to 5. It's not a proper 9 to 5. Dude, my story's not It's the not same bad. hours. No, it isn't. Sorry, it's, it's half an hour less. My bad. <laughs> Do you know what? No, no. Nine to five is like Monday, Monday to Friday, nine a.m. to five a. five p.m. If it is nine hours to five hours, then it yeah, is a nine still, to five. Yeah, but you still work less throughout the week. The nine to five is the hours, not the weekdays. That's why the song the goes. Of hours in the. That's week. why the song goes. Working nine to five. They don't say working. Seven days a week and nine to five. Because it's implied that the nine to five is... The nine to five is the hours. Technically, if you work from nine to five, you are working a nine to five job. Oh You're just God. being fucking influenced by public stigma, you fucking government sheep. <laughs> the fuck? You're what being brainwashed. That? Being brainwashed. I have a story from oh, work, actually. Let us hear. I encountered a Karen. Oh! I encountered a Karen in real life. Holy shit, what was your first experience she like? She was this ugly, nasty whore with, like, Ooh. fucking, like, moles on her face. Don't like, let hear you talk shit right, about well, don't dox me. <laughs> oh, yeah, I cu uh, cut out Chris's workplace. I will. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, right, you're... Okay, keep, keep talking. But, no, it was, like, this woman, and I think she said she, she was, like hyper allergic to dogs which is because some some customer came in with their dog which i saw and i didn't really give a fuck about um because I, I wasn't sure if we were if we let dogs in mm -hmm. so i was just like i don't care it's also not in your job description it's also not because i'm not a manager I'm just or a even fucking, a, or even in like a clerk or anything i'm a little slave boy <laughs> i don't know what i'm fucking doing either but uh but if you were to pick a fight I would decimate them. Anyway, keep talking. But if I'm in a killing mood, of course. <laughs> I saw I saw the dog, and I was like, okay, whatever. Why? What is wrong with this jump? I don't know. I don't think. I think. You're I think you're going about wrong. it wrong somehow. Yeah, the thing is, I'm trying to move stuff, but I don't see what to move. Anyways, uh, so what happened with the Karen, sir? Um, so I see the lady with the dog, and I'm like, okay, whatever. I don't really care, and eh, like, I don't know if I have to make it leave or not. So. Like a couple minutes goes by, and some like middle aged white woman, like ginger, fat, um, <laughs> and not wearing a mask, mm, oh. enters the store. And she comes up to me, she walks up, she power walks up to me because you know she jogs, mm -hmm. she starts speed walks. Um, she fucking walks up to me, and she's like, ah, Could you get the lady with the dog to get out of the store, please? I'm hyper allergic to dogs, and you know if I if I smell their scent, I'll I'll go, I'll I'll 
I won't be able to breathe, and I'll just die. You want to know what might filter some of that out later? Yeah. No, and and then, like, I think she could tell I was just looking at her like she was a re- Because she fucking, like, she was like, I don't need to wear the mask because I have, like, a card that says if I put the mask on, I'll fucking die. She's not, like, no. I don't know. Whatever. Yeah. Not my job. So, so I was like, uh, okay, um. Isn't that just... I know, and then she bitched me out for a bit, like, you shouldn't even let dogs into the store. Um. Uh, I'm a lady, I'm... I'm a lady. I'm not even a cashier, sir. I'm 50 years old, I know what I'm doing. Um, uh, what the fuck do I do? So, at Manning, or I... Uh, no, I'm not done my story Oh, yet. you're not done. Play for a bit while I tell okay. the story, because I can't focus. <laughs> Um, so she, like, bitches me out, and then, like, I think a homeless person walks past me, because every homeless person has, like, a backpack on, because mm. they don't want to, like, leave it outside to get stolen, yeah. and she, like, looks at that chick, scoffs, and walks slightly away, and then, like, the chick is, or the fucking Karen is still bitching me out about there being a dog in the store, so I'm like, okay, I'll go see what I can do, where is she, and she points to her, do you know where she was standing? She was at the fucking checkout, getting her shit checked out. She was about to pay and leave. And and, and then I looked at, I looked back at her, and I'm like, okay, I'll go handle this. And I started and walking over there, and then I realized she wasn't looking at me anymore, so I walked right back to what the fuck I was doing. <laughs> I feel like we're missing something really obvious. Yeah. That is such a Chris moment. You don't, you and don't argue, you just kind of be like, oh yeah, sure, I'll do that. And, and then don't. And then she later walked back to me, and she was like, did you force her to leave? And I, I was just like, um, yeah, I talked to her, but, like, she's checking out right now. Like, she's paying right now. And she's like, well, I can't wait that long. I'm, I want to pay, too. Do you think I'm going to stand in line to wait for someone to pay? And like, what everybody else does? And then she, like, you know, thinks I'm lesser than a human and walks away. And then the homeless person walks back over and they're like Jesus Christ some people am I right and then she started talking to me about people being cunts and I'm like yeah lady well I'm trying <laughs> to do my job <laughs> I didn't really care I was just like oh my god that's fucking but that's the end wow. of my story okay. some Karen wanted me to fucking I know. have been having a lot of my very fir like baby's first Karens but weirdly enough they're all Carl's <laughs> they're not I don't get don't female don't disrespect the name Carl fuck you uh, I'm uh I get only male Karens so my major my major one was featuring a guy and his re kid I'll push it forward oh we are so fucking <laughs> oh dumb oh my god <laughs> Oh yeah, I was, my I was thinking, god! Like, I'm pretty no, sure you're supposed I, to walk on I was, that. I was gonna check. I'm like, see, I, I pushed pull it forward. Back? <laughs> I pushed forward and it didn't move. No, because I was, I was like, I was, I was under the impression that you could only Anyways. move it side to side. Yeah, and then so, I pushed sorry. it, like I moved it back, and I'm like, can you push it forward? I wonder. We had a guy, and I'm not gonna say. I, cool. I cut out when I call this kid a mean word. No, just what's his fake name? So you can okay. Fake name. Uh, we'll call him uh, uh, Lord Charmelius. Lord Charmelius? He was a foreign guy. Uh, we'll call him Lord Charmelius, and his son was Charmelius the Mini. Charmelius Jr. Yeah, Charmelius Jr. Uh, Charmelius Jr. really wanted to learn to ski. You know, he was super into it. Except he had never learned to ski before. He never even touched ski. So I was like, okay, Charmelius Jr., I'm going to take you, uh, take you down to the novice area, just that flat part down there, and we're just going to do some basic beginner stuff. You know, try and get you to work your way up to going all the way down. He goes, okay. And, uh, oh, new hat. Yo. Wait. Oh, oh no. And a, and a boy. Is that a new hat? No, it was just a boy there. Oh. I wish Anyways. he could wear the hat. Uh, Mr. Charmelius, I, I, I give him the, uh, that. <laughs> I, I give him the, uh, I give him the general spiel, like, uh, just, if your kid quits, I cannot do anything about it because okay, a lot of on, kids... What? I just like to say, Chris, when you looked at me, that just made me think of the fucking <laughs> Iron Man meme where he's like, clearly you don't own a deep fryer <laughs> <laughs> or an air fryer. Clearly you don't have a father figure. <laughs> oh, yo, there it is. It's a oh. rake. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> Anyways. Uh, yeah, so I was talking to Miss, uh, Lord Charmelius, and he, uh, he really, really wanted me to do the full lesson. And I was like, okay, but if your kid quits, I can't do shit about it. Is there lighter in there, too? I don't think so. Um, Let me match with her. Anyways. Uh, he... 
and I told him, I tried to tell him, like, if your kid quits, I can't do shit about it, because people seem to think that we can just sort of, um... Make people like, shove, like, shove their kid down the hill and let them go when they quit, mm. which we can't do. If they're done, they're done. We can't force them to do anything. We go down to the novice area, and within the first five minutes, I swear to God, the kid's like, I'm gonna go down, and he starts running. Like, on his skis, so he's faster than me, because we're on a slant. I didn't bring my skis, because I thought we were staying in the novice area, and he's bolting. He's long gone. And he starts sliding down the hill top speed. I'm trying to, I'm rushing down there. Kid crashes, like, hard, like, ass <laughs> over tea kettle. Charmelius Jr. down. Like, he was, he was fucked, and he was crying. And I try to talk, I, I try to talk to him, like, I'm trying to calm him down, because I finally get to the bottom after, like, not having my skis, and I bring him back up, and he quits, understandable. Like, yeah. you were a dumbass, but you're a kid, I can accept that. His dad walks up to me afterwards and says, how did the lesson go? And I had to tell him, you know, okay, well, your kid quit, because he crashed, and he, like, he ran away. And, um, he's like, but you only went for, like, ten minutes. Sir, your kid quit because he crashed within the first ten minutes. You didn't even have your skis, though. That wasn't his fault. Sir, I didn't have skis because I explained to both of you less than ten minutes ago that I wasn't bringing them because we were staying in the novice area. Your kid looked me in the eyes, said that he was gonna bolt, and then did. Uh, he then said that I was a bad instructor. Uh, he went off for a few minutes about the whole resort, and then asked me if he could get a refund. I go, sir, uh, maybe. I don't give refunds. I teach lessons to stupid kids like yours. And... I didn't say that, obviously, because I, I was more, it was more just, um... You said it more like corpse husband. <laughs> yeah, sir. Um, your kid's a fucking retard. Your kid's a retard. Your kid's a fucking dumbass. Uh, but yeah, anyways. And, uh, all he does is fucking grumble and walk away from me. I get, uh, later on, I, my boss comes up to me and is like, you got a complaint today. And I, I, I already know who it is, but I was like, oh, from who? Yeah, some guy who was mad because you, you only did, like, a ten-minute lesson. What the hell? I couldn't say anything. And I see him on the way down. He was like, sorry for reporting you. I was just, I was, I was pretty upset, you know? <laughs> you bitch. Like, don't just say, like, oh, yeah, sorry. For sorry that. for giving me my first, like, negative report at a job ever. Wait, why couldn't you say anything? you fired? What? Why couldn't you have said it? Oh, I, I, I said something, and my boss was just like, okay, well, just don't do it again. I didn't do anything. But, yeah, just don't yeah. do something that you can't control yeah. again. Uh, but that was my major Karen encounter, and it was not a Karen. Ah! Holy shit! All right, well. Can you, can you, <laughs> Chris, can you put impact font that says bottle flip? Yeah. Thanks. <laughs>